What's up guys? So much like everybody else, I am stuck at home and I'm bored. So I thought, why not make some cupcakes? However, yeah, it's kind of boring. So I thought I'd make it interesting by wearing a blindfold. I did actually order a blindfold, however it didn't turn up. So instead I'm just going to wrap this tea towel around my head and see how it goes. So uh, yeah, blindfolded cupcakes. Okay. So starting with the flour. I need three quarters of a cup of flour. So, I hope that's half a cup. And somewhere, here we go, is, could be a quarter. Right. Okay. Cast the sugar. All right. Half a cup. The sugar. Hardest thing here is I've actually had to memorize the recipe because, well, I can't exactly read it while wearing a blindfold. There's half a cup of caster sugar. I hope. Oh man, this stuff is doesn't have much of a feel to it. I really don't know. We'll go with that. Hopefully that's a quarter of a cup. Okay, and then, the box. Here we go. And somewhere here, a teaspoon, or two teaspoons actually, of baking powder. I hope all's going well. I won't really know this until I actually get to editing the video. Somewhere there should be some vanilla Essence. There we go. I went off my spoon. Oh, there we go. Okay. Um, pretty sure it's two teaspoons of of this. Okay, that was a lot. I heard that, and I've lost. Oh, no, there's a lid. Uh, milk. Milk. Eggs. Okay, half a cup, because that's a small cup, maybe eight of milk. Oops, that was a bit, a bit much. Oh well, here we go. Oh, we need two eggs. Now this is the difficult bit, because I don't want to put any shell in there. No, wait, no. One. Lost my eggs again. Two eggs, hopefully in the bowl. Now I think that was everything. I'm gonna go try and find the mixer, that's the sink, there we go. Put that on. Okay, dropping down. Okay, here's we've got all that hooked up properly. That up, hopefully. Um, you can see it, I currently cannot. Oh, that's my tray. Okay. You know what? I forgot the freaking butter. I knew there was something else, but right. let's add that now. Freaking idiot. So I need 80 grams of butter. This could make a bit of a difference. Okay, let's try again. Now, I really hope it's mixed in properly. Now, I did count out 12 of these when I was laying my stuff out. So hopefully, we got 12 of them in the end. Now this is the dangerous bit. Well actually, not so much putting it in, getting it out is going to be the friggin' one is the trick. Okay. Ow! Slide that in. 
Okay, that's in there. So um, let's take this off and see how much of a mess I made. I'm uh, gonna clean this up with the blindfold off and we'll uh, get ready to make some icing. Okay, we're back, cleaned up. The oven went ding, so that means what is hopefully cupcakes are ready. Um, but, no cheating. So, blindfold is going back on. So we don't get to see these things until they are actually done. Okay. Pull it down so I can't see at the bottom. And, uh, right, let's switch this off. I really hope they're cooked it. Okay. Now, this is the dangerous spot because I've got to try and pick this tray up without burning myself. Now, that's quite hot. There you go. Hopefully, there's some cupcakes there. Now, we're going to make some icing. So, not forget the butter this time. No, that should be not here. Yet. Okay. Let's show this here. Butter up a bit. Crap, I've lost the tea towel again. Never mind. Okay. We're going freehand this time. Trying to gradually add the icing sugar and kind of difficult when you can't see to know if it's mixing or not. to do what we did last time and whoops, dump a heap in. I don't know, that'll do. Crap, lid rolled away. Found it. And we also need the milk. And there should be another spoon around here somewhere. Think, I hope. Sure, I got it out. Feels like it. One, two. I got like a lot. Hopefully, that wasn't too much. And now, whoop, where the hell's everything? I'm gonna do. I've got a four pack of colours. I want to make purple. Sorry, I have a red and a blue here. <sighs> Come on, which one's which? I'm gonna go with that being blue. I'll just set that there. Come on, speak to me, colours. I feel that's a green. I'm getting a feeling that's a yellow, so we'll go with this one. Well, it's a bit of, a bit of that. I don't know how much of that it was, but it's a bit of that. Let's add a bit of this. Well, okay, hopefully we're gonna have purple. Oh, 
Okay. I'm hoping it's mixed enough and I'm hoping it's purple. Okay, I'm back and I have put the icing into a piping bag. Uh, originally I wasn't going to look at it, however I, when I went to clean up it was all over the beaters so I knew that it was green and not the purple that I intended. So yeah, may have thought just may as well get that bit out of the way. Lucky I did because the bag I was going to put it in split down the side and made a horrible mess. Cupcakes have cooled and are underneath that tea towel still. Pretty sure I've failed fairly good there, uh, as I can just you know feel that they're not large cupcakes. So to resolve that, what I'm going to do is take two of them, stick some buttercream in there, bang them together, then we'll do the tops and add some hundreds and thousands. So uh, yeah, let's get into it. While I'm rolled on. Very carefully. Okay. So. Okay. Wow, that was denser. Blown out the side. Okay. Um, plan B, I guess. Fucking idea's got blasted out the freaking window. I guess that's what you get for buying cheap, crappy piping stuff. Right. Just turn it on. Sometimes you've got to work with what you got. And in this particular case, what I got ain't very good. I suppose it, it is fitting that um, my piping bag ends up basically as good as my cupcakes cook. Try to get it done. Let's begin. Let's make this stuff on top. Okay, there's another one. Now, somewhere here, here we go. have an old spice jar. Hundreds and thousands in it. No. It's just decorated. Certainly decorated the table. There we go! Six! Beautiful cupcakes. The big reveal. Oh boy. <laughs> oh. Okay, um Yep. That's about all I've got to say about that. I mean they're not pretty. Okay, the moment of truth. Mm. Okay. They're not horrible, but uh, they also aren't great. They're kind of edible. Very, very sweet. So, um, if you want cupcakes to eat or to even look good, I suggest not wearing a blindfold while you make them. So after that failed uh, attempt at making cupcakes, I actually made another batch, which is uh, this here, to, um, to make sure that I actually could make them from scratch, as I normally I just do a uh, packet mix. But yeah, turned out pretty good. This is kind of more along the lines of what I was uh, looking for in the first place. And um, yeah, not bad. 
Tastes a lot better. Looks better. I mean, what do you expect though when you were cooking wearing a blindfold? So I uh, hope you enjoyed the video and I will catch you in the next one. If I bleed tonight, if I am sad tonight, I don't have a job.